What you see before you is an outline of Operation Meal Mirage. Our response to Operation Jormungand. <laughs> I knew it. It doesn't stray too far from what we'd expected, but even so... Seeing it all laid out like this makes it overwhelmingly real. I get that a plan this crazy is probably our only hope, but still... We're really gonna do this, huh? <laughs> The Empire has drastically increased its military might, due largely in part to the draft. Current estimates number their forces at 1.2 million strong, and that figure will only rise before the fighting actually starts. On the other hand, Calvert's military can barely scrape together 800,000. At most, even if they try to boost their ranks with a draft of their own, that probably won't go over too well. Judging by their last election. Not to mention the huge difference in weapons and resources between the two countries. In terms of both aerial combat fleets and core tank units, Erebonia has a clear advantage. And that's without taking Panzer Soldats into account. Yeah. There's no way the Vern Company's production line could even hope to keep up. What's more, the Empire now has an excuse to throw all the new technology it's been developing into this war. With that in mind, it's entirely possible that the Civil War was nothing more than an opening move. I agree. It seems likely. The same could be said of the Orbal Shutdown Phenomenon, or even the Hundred Days War. It is our belief that these events were simply set up, all to pave the way for Operation Jormungand. <laughs> Damn it! Those monsters! And Meal Mirage is your plan for how to hold back Operation Jormungand. We have with us the Republican Army of Calvard, the Royal Army of Liberal, the Remifarian and Viceland armies, as well as troops from Lamont and Orid, and even resistance cells acting out of Crossbell and North Amber. You intend to coordinate every one of these individual forces united under a single banner to suppress the Imperial Army from all sides. That's exactly right. As you stated before, Calvert's armed forces total 800,000 The Viceland army should bring that number up by about 100,000. The Principality of Remiferia is prepared to lend its aid as well, to the effect of approximately 80,000 troops. Add to that figure an additional 120,000 from the Kingdom of Liberal. Further, we can count on receiving around 20,000 soldiers from Lamont and Orid combined, as well as another 10,000 from Crossbell and North Ambria. And this is to remain off the record, but we're expecting roughly 30,000 in reinforcements from Arteria as well. Naturally, we plan on bringing Jaegers into the fight, too. We've been scouting out Jaeger corps big and small. All in all, I'd say we're looking at a good 40,000 extra soldiers. Altogether a combined total of 1.2 million, finally putting us on even ground with Operation Jormungand. A war like this would stretch over almost half the continent. Resistance cells from Crossbell, huh? That must be Sonya and the others. Yeah, Muriel told me a bit about it, but... Northambria, too? That have something to do with the movements we heard about there? Yeah. The resistance there is made up of former members of the Northern Jaegers, who got absorbed into the Imperial Army. And we got troops from Lamont and Orid, too. That would be their defense forces, no? That's right. We've actually known about their involvement for a little bit. I have to say, I'm surprised the High Seat of the Septian Church would choose to involve themselves so directly. But Rosine mentioned something about this earlier, didn't she? Yes. The Congregation for Divine Worship is likely deploying the Papal Guard as we speak. The Imperial Army's technological superiority is undeniable, and we can't underestimate the threat Ouroboros poses either. Further, directing and coordinating all parties involved will prove a tremendously difficult task. That is the purpose of our meeting to determine who will serve as the key piece in our plan, the cornerstone upon which we can build our success. I present to you Cassius Bright, Lieutenant General of the Royal Army of Liberal, and, as of today, Supreme Commander of Operation Meal Mirage. <laughs> what? Now that's what I call a power move. A natural decision. Lieutenant General Bright did head the search and destroy operations against the cult in Crossbell. What's more, he can already boast having pushed back an Imperial invasion once before. He's the most brilliant tactician of our time, without a doubt. I should have known. 
So you've accepted the position then, Dad? Even after hearing everything that's going to happen as a result of this plan? I have. This can truly be called the Great War. The likes of which mankind has never seen before. A war that will surely destroy the lives of all it touches. Soldiers and civilians alike. Hundreds of thousands of lives. Worst comes to worst, we could see casualties in the million. <laughs> Millions? Yeah. That's definitely possible. But at least it will keep the Empire from completely destroying everything. Yeah. She has a point. I think I speak for us all when I say this dreadful decision weighs heavily on our hearts. But there are stakes here far more dire than the invasion of Calvert itself. Namely, Erebonia's two Septarians, as well as its curse, which spreads further and further with every land it conquers. Ugh, it's all connected. If we don't act soon, the Republic will fall to the Empire's advance, drowning the entire nation in its curse. It would then only be a matter of time before the surrounding countries fell as well, until finally all of Zemuria is in the Curse's grasp, all for the sake of reviving the ultimate being, the Great One. This we must avoid, above all else. If this dreadful decision is the only chance we have of saving our world, then so be it. This whole catastrophe began in Erebonia. Though I can't personally agree to this plan, as a member of the Imperial family, I must allow it. Your Highness... <laughs> this is the consensus we have reached. I trust you understand now the reason we've gathered here. There are a few things we must ask you now. Namely, if you accept the necessity of our plan. And furthermore, if we can count on your cooperation. I'm sure you'd like some time to talk things over amongst yourselves. And with your other allies as well. But as you can probably tell, that's time we just don't have. Members of the Bracer Guild, Special Support Section, Class 7, and Thor's Military Academy as a whole, we need your answers. Here and now. How do you respond? When it comes down to it, we, the Special Support Section, are just a single division of the CPD. We're in no position to defy the will of a nation, let alone four. We understand the severity of the situation, but be that as it may, we can't in good faith lend our aid to this cause. There has to be a better way to fix this mess we're in, and we won't back down until we figure out how. Not just to stop this war, but so that someday... Crossbell can take back its independence for good. <laughs> I see. You can count the Bracer Guild out of this deal too. We're the supporting gauntlet of the common people. Their security and protection will always come first. But at the same time, we understand that you have to do this. So instead, we'll make sure to get in touch with our headquarters in Le Mans to organize an evacuation plan for all the citizens. And in the meantime, We'll look for our own way to resolve this. Just like the SSS. That's the Bracer Guild's decision. Estelle. Ah. <laughs> With so many of us still missing, we can't claim to speak for Thor's as a whole. But we can, at the very least, tell you our decision as Class 7. Become the foundation of the world. In a sense, those words have shaped our class from the very beginning. A war this big is certainly one way to keep the curse in check. We could be a new foundation afterwards. One built over ruins and destruction. But this curse is not absolute. Though it sweeps across the nation, toying with our fate, there are still those who stand together to resist it. We've seen as much with our very own eyes. We need a plan to try and ensure the safety of the world as we know it. Meal Mirage can be that plan, but like the Guild and the SSS, we choose to find a third path forward for ourselves. That means dealing with any incidents brought about by the curse, as well as the rivalries. Whether or not that's even possible, I don't know. 
Time is running out on us even as we speak. Yet still, we'll continue to tread forward, step by step. Because we owe it to Prince Oliver to find that third path he always strove to take. Reen. Yeah, you're exactly right. The path Prince Oliver would have wanted. I see. <laughs> My goodness. The naivete of youth never fails to astound me. And yet, as history shows us, it is precisely the young and foolish who bring change to the world. The same could be said of those not bound by duty or tradition. Come to think of it, Prince Oliver himself embodied every one of those qualities. <laughs> He most certainly did, and his spirit lives on in this next generation. We have heard your convictions, clear and true. Operation Meal Mirage is already underway. But so long as you respect our position, we will respect yours in turn. You're under no obligation to participate in our plan. That said, we'd appreciate your help wherever possible. That includes exchanging information, keeping civilians safe, and so on. We certainly have more room to cooperate than Operation Jormungong does at the very least. You bracers played a pivotal role in solving the incidents in Liburo, as did the special support section in Crossbell. I eagerly await seeing what such seasoned heroes can bring to the table. Thank you. We won't disappoint. I don't know if I'd call us heroes exactly, but we'll help out in any way we can. Huh. <laughs> well, that suspense was killing me. As grim as our circumstances are, we now know what our mission must be. Right! We gotta do everything we can to stop this war before it begins. And even if it does, we'll just have to find a way to end it. Right. Our first course of action is figuring out exactly what we can accomplish right now as members of Thor's. I imagine the rivalries will play a key role in that. Agreed. <laughs> You're all pretty gung-ho about this, huh? Uh, how are you guys so relentlessly positive about everything? It really is the most annoying thing about them, isn't it? Wait a sec. I know that voice! It's him! Enforcer number zero of Ouroboros. Campanella! Show yourself! <laughs> Sounds like things are coming along nicely over here. Quite the illustrious guest list you have here. I'm almost starstruck. Indeed. It would seem the rumors weren't unfounded. Belle! The new third Anguis of Ouroboros. Lady Mildine, my greetings to you and all the leaders of the world gathered here today. I see a number of familiar faces and some new ones too. My, how delightful! You must be Dieter Kroisis' daughter. I've heard the rumors of what you've become. A member of an international terrorist organization. Gracious me, the audacity of this woman. Whoa, he really called it, huh, Lady Belle? Ha, you're one to talk. Hey, uh, this is some party you guys got going on. Real swanky joint, too. Shame for you, Zephyr's here to crash. Surely! You- Boss! That means Zeno and Leo are here too, doesn't it? Sure does. But hey, we're not done with the lineup just yet. Don't think things will go the same for you here as they did at the workshop. Please, excuse our intrusion. Sharon. George! So you've come. Lecter. It's really you. In the flesh. Long time no see, ladies. My lady, everyone, I apologize for interrupting such an important meeting. <sighs> you should have just kept the mask on, Angie. If you're all quite finished, it's time I make the final introduction. Your Highness! Cedric, why are you- Ah, if it isn't my dear sister, Alvin, at Class 7. Your little stunt in leaves caused me no end of headaches. <laughs> You had it coming! That's what you get for getting Elise and Tio all wrapped up in your schemes! That's simply how it works between us. You should understand this by now. The rivalries are no different. But this particular matter has been entrusted to me, by Chancellor Osborne himself. Consider this a little congratulatory visit from us, to celebrate the commencement of Operation Meal Mirage. Were we just hacked? Yep. 
They probably used the Society's Astral Code to infiltrate the system. Courtesy of Bell and the Fool, I'd assume. Sounds like we're in for a fair bit of trouble then, huh? Yeah. They're coming. What the? Damn. They brought Imperial warships. No. Not quite. This is the bridge. We have an emergency. We've got eight Crimson ships approaching on our nine. And... and with them... A 280 Arch class airship! Damn! There's only one ship that friggin' massive. You mean, the one that appeared during the Orbal shutdown? That's right. Ouroboros's pride and joy. The largest battleship in the history of mankind. The Crimson Ark. The Glorious. I'm turning the mic back on. This is just hype right now. Holy shit. I didn't want to talk in the mic before, but like, damn. This is all sides. All the enemies we're facing. And we're in a deep situation. Hopefully. We can survive this. I see, so it's just a. Advanced warning predicting. Oh, but it's not one of the Empire ships, but one of Ouroboros' aircraft carriers. What does that mean? As if they expected us. At the end of the meeting, Her Highness did make one prediction that either the Imperial Air Force or Ouroboros battle carrier appear in these skies. Fucking Muse. Where the Imperial Air Force, their progress so down the path of lines will be deterred in a sense. This airspace is within the above the boards with the leaders of each state on board. An attack on the ship would simply be too reckless. If we were successfully captured, this would have been a massive effect on cross-national negotiations. And I would instantly bring a halt to the war. That's what she was betting on, wasn't it? Things turn out differently though. They opted for an Ouroboros affiliated ship instead. And since seeing the princess and the other leaders in tune here, Add fuel to the fire for war. No. Damn it. So they were playing depending on Calvert, aren't they? This is no joke, we can't let this happen. Of course, I swear in the honor of the Bracer Guild. You guys called us here knowing that this would happen, didn't you? Correct, and it worked out perfectly. We still have an escape route available for our guests, so you need to worry about that. Can I get you each to divide your troops in half? Have them accompany you to the hangar? Enemy forces are coming from the deck. I'd like you to take the remaining half to help take care of them. Let's divide the two groups then. One for the starboard and one for the port. Well, you guys are prepared that far in advance? If that's the command. We don't have much time. Let's decide on the groups. Be sure to balance teams well. Understood. Green, Lloyd, Estelle, divide everyone's team. Make sure to keep them balanced. The result counterattack was made led by Reen, Class 7 with Estelle, Joshua, Ren, Lloyd, Ellie, T of Crow, Dooley, and the others. Our members work with Aurelia and making their way on uh, hold, ensuring the safety of the national leaders. Oh shoot, boys. We're bringing out all our best physical users. That's all we're doing. I think we can survive this without magic, comrade. This would be hard, of course, but I think we can survive this without magic. And the girl's side, 
Estelle, Ran, Ellie, Tio. Alright. Damn, this is a big group. Dang it! Altina and Yuna have to join? God damn it. Physical, magic, magic, magic. Balance, defensive, magic. We have too many magic users, by the way. Hmm. It's been at least so long. Alright, boys. The girls. Team girl team is here. Damn. Damn it, I don't like the fact that we have fixed members, like, you know. You know, like, goddamn new class 7 units. Now, shall we get going? Best of luck, all of you! You guys be careful, okay? Wait, what in the world's going on? Whatever it is, it looks like we got a real juicy scoop on our hands. Not now. We're oh, under no attack. you don't. I believe you all know what it is you must do. Yeah. We got this. Just leave it to us. All right, boys. We got ourselves a situation here. Now then. Shall we move out our cell? We are currently under attack by Ouroboros's enhanced Jaegers and members of the Red Constellation. The Red Constellation, huh? Gonna be a real pain in the ass, especially with the Blitz there. Yeah, no kidding. Gilbert's probably heading up the enhanced Jaegers. <laughs> Gilbert. Not that anything to worry about. <laughs> Gilbert. His archaisms might still give us some trouble, though. Gilbert knows Speak he's for yourself. useless because Estelle insulted. I'll make insulted. sure that little errand boy regrets ever stepping foot in here. Ash, Kurt. I'll be counting on you. <laughs> you got it! Understood. We must stop His Highness. Yuna, Altina, we're going to need your support as well. Of course! Let's do this, Ellie! I'll give it my best. Alright, guys. It's time to begin our joint operation. Team A will go starboard. Team B, you head port. Our current position is the rear side of the lower deck. Let's make our way up to the top deck. Take out any intruders you find along the way. Right! Let's do this. Welcome to Hype. This is Hype. We got ourselves a situation. We're surrounded. And we have our best users. This will be the perfect chance to put our teamwork to the test, huh? It's our time to shine, Reen. Yeah. Let's go! Let's fucking do this, boys. Right. Show me what you've got, Lloyd. Let's do this. Our MC powers teaming up together. Switch teams A and B in this mission. Keep switching two teams, blah blah blah. Teams will emerge, all members are equipped for and ready for battle. I think I know what I'm gonna do. Everyone has their own quartz, I guess. Damn. I'm fucking ready. Let's fucking do this, boys. Oh, Fee has rage. Fee, give me. Where's your rage? Oh, wait. You have rage. Should I give this to then? Sarah? Damn, they're locked. God dang it. Uh, oh well. I wanted to use guys, but I guess that won't be the case. Let's go! Hey! Ready to go! <laughs> Moving out! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! It's my turn! 
them quick! Ha! It's my turn! There! Ready to go! We have a lot of orders. Especially for Reen as well. Oh man, this is so... I'm actually excited. Holy shit. Give him hell! Crimson break! Moving out! Oh, I should've used Raging Hammer. Oh well. Let's do this! Tuck. An opening! You're wide open! Moving out! Judgment time! He's dead! They're down! Too slow! It's my turn! Huh. It's my turn! Hey! Yeah. They're open! An opening! Impressive! Nothing gets past Detective Bannings, huh? <laughs> Not with you fighting by my side! MC Powers Unite? All right, got it. I don't understand why this is a five out of ten. Holy shit! Ready. That one looks tough. Watch yourselves. This will be tough. Hmm. Raging Hammer. Break them. Raging Hammer! Roar! <gasps> Helix Strike! It's down! There! It's my turn! Look! Ha! I've got this! Let's do this! Tuck. An opening! You're wide open! All right! Swiftly! Shadow formation! My turn! Showtime! They're down! Too slow! My turn! There! Too slow! Moving out! Let's do this! Tuck. Not bad, if I say so myself. That's how it's done. I must train even more. <laughs> nice! Nice. <laughs> nice! You're a natural, Reen. That eight leaves technique of yours isn't just for show. Thanks. You've been holding your own in battles yourself. All comes down to excellent teamwork. Keep it up. Huh. Got a hot table here. Yeah. Moving out. Wreak havoc! Chaos Storm! Ready to go! You're finished! Yeah! There! You're wide open! Alright! Judgment time! Eat this! There! Too slow! You're finished! Let's go! Zero Breaker! I'm up! Crimson Slash! Moving out! Ha! An opening! You're wide open! 
<laughs> Damn good show you put on. I'd say I still have a long ways to go. Not bad. You ain't seen nothing yet. Watch out! Hey, hey yeah. tough. Gonna have to step up our game for this one. Yeah. Right. Yeah. All right. Break them. Raging hammer. Moving out. Judgment time! Need this! Ready to go! You're finished! Yeah! Jesus. Let's go! Yeah! Let's go! Take this! Infernal Gale! speed of yours is no joke, Joshua. <laughs> yeah, but you're way more skilled with a sword. Damn, I want to collect more convo. Not much to worry about when we got a team like this. Still, I'd hate to be a burden. I'll do what I can to keep up. Huh! Shit! Ha! Ready. You old-timers just sit back and relax. I could do this shit in my sleep. Shit! Fucking hell. All right, I think it's Agate's turn. Let's link up with jo Lo Joshua. Hello, how are we on time? We making good stride? Yeah, we're making good stride. This place. The staircase past here should take us to the deck. <laughs> right. That's how you ran off with the princess two years ago. Oh, yeah. Uh, I heard about that. <laughs> wow. Not bad at all. I, I rescued her. Don't go giving people the wrong idea, Crow. Fucking Crow. Sure. Us. Okay. Okay. If you say so. Selling okay, us like we that. can tease him about it some other time, Ash. Christ, guys. You guys are just making fun of me of that incident. Oh, yeah, I just zoom my way past here. Watch out. Duck. Oh. Hmm, nice dodge. Uh oh, we're surrounded. The old dogs finally come out to play, huh? Gareth the Blitz. Damn, just our luck to run into a heavy hitter this early. Can't say I'm too thrilled to see him again either. It's nice to see you again too, young master. And you have Detective Lloyd Bannings with you as well. It's been a while. So it has. Never thought we'd cross paths again after your last stint in mains. Huh. These are my new hunting grounds. 
You can forget about making it to the upper deck. I suggest you retreat now. Sorry, but that's not how we do things. Yeah, the hell kind of wusses you take us for. Mere strength in numbers won't be enough to make us yield. That's right. You'll be the ones retreating, Red Constellation. Ha! You wish, Black Fang. I've been itching to take you and those Chevaliers on for a while. Having the young master here is just an added bonus. Men, ready your weapons. Let's see them withstand the sting of the Red Scorpion. Yeah! Yeah. <laughs> here they come. Take cover from the snipers and aim to break their formation. What the? He's standing there. Defeat ground enemies. Alright guys. Everyone in defensive formations, which is the defensive formations. I guess that mine is a defensive formation. Hold fast! Black tortoise formation! I wanna scan. Ha! Too slow! Ow. <laughs> Dick move! I've got this! Yeah! I see you! An opening! An opening! I didn't think they attacked like that. Ha! I've got you! You're finished! Damn! Ow. Let's go! Did I get everyone? Yeah! It's my turn! Take this! Infernal Gale! <laughs> huh? Ready to go! Let's do this! Touch him! An opening! There! <laughs> Damn you! It's my turn! <laughs> right! Keep being in defensive formation! Black tortoise formation! Right! Zero Breaker! Now! An opening! <laughs> Payback! Ha! Aw, oh, dick move! I see you! Let's go! Take this! Infernal Gale! Huh? <laughs> Alright! Let's finish this! This is it! Dragon Ball! Moving out! Let's do this! You're finished! Are they really just healing? Dick move, by the way. How are they fast? Let's go! Let's go! Crimson Flash! I've got this! Let's do this! There! You and me, Agate! You got it! Jesus! I've got your finish! Ready to go! Ha! 
Thanks. It's my turn. What? They're open. An oh, opening. I failed. Ready to go. Hold fast. Black tortoise formation. Ready to go. Nice. Ha! It's my turn. Now! There! Ha! I've got your finish! Moving out! Let's do this! An opening! It's my turn! Nice. Drop you! There's no stopping us! Bridge deck seats for level 8. What the? It's more powerful than mine! What the? Alright! Got it! Nice! I did it! There we go! <laughs> nice! I must train even more! <laughs> nice! The underdogs bite back, but he forces her cheat before no one said it'd be easy. It's all good, we held them back long enough. Retreat for now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a flash grenade. They're gone just like that. I knew these will something like this. I wonder how TB is gonna do. They're actually able to retreat in that split second. That was fast. Get back here, we're not done with you. Leave them. We got bigger fish to fry to the upper deck. That's one obstacle clear. Let's keep going. Yeah. And on team B, team girl team, girl power. Yeah. I hate that Yuna and Altina are required members. Which makes me very sad. Because I want to use Fee and Laura, but I don't think that's going to be the case. And Duvali is randomly in, our, in the team. Alright. Let's finish off the, the girls' side of the, of the team. Huh. Ready to roll! Huh. <laughs> yeah! Now's our chance! We got Lightning Sword, Sledgehammer, Cross Strike, Accelerate, Aeon Shield, Calamity Spear. These two things are for magic users. Breakthrough! Sledgehammer! Commencing Drive! Team Arts. Yes. Ha. Now. Gotcha. Right. Some good data. Yeah, I did it. 
Not bad, if I do say so myself. Ready to roll! Watch out! That one looks tough! Basically, sledgehammer, you know, just wrecking havoc. Orcas activate! Beginning analysis. Analysis complete. Let's go! to me let's go orbital gear exa activate ha! orbital laser fire this team is very interesting because we have a physical estelle and now we have the magic teal and ellie on our team It's my turn. Crackle! Lightning sword! It's my turn. There! I've got you! It's my turn. Yeah! Now's the time! Follow up. Yes. Ready? You. Leave it to me. Here I go. Take this. Ha! They're off guard. Follow up. Damn, it's, it's been my stunned turn. for days. There. I've got you. My turn now. Too slow. Great out there. Meh. I see. <laughs> Level up. Uh -huh. I did it. Summon Obergild too. What the? That's forbidden. Diligence is its own reward. Stats updated. Wow, Yuna. I'm impressed. Yeah. Aw, thanks. <laughs> right back at ya. You're really kicking some butt out there. Those two seem to work well together. Yep. They're pretty much on the same wavelength. Yes. Leave it to me. I could say the same about you two. Da -da -da -da, run! Do what Lisa does. Let's Shoot. finish this up quick. There we go. My turn. Ha! Huh? My turn. Let's go. Yes. Ready? You. Good luck. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Well, that's not the best idea. Ha. It's 
my turn. Yeah! Leave it to me. Ha! Now, let's keep going. Ellie's gonna run out of mana. I can catch my breath now. Sooner or later. Be wary. That foe is fearsome. Ha! Everyone remain vigilant. Break through! Sledgehammer! Take that! Hi! Oof. Let's go. Timmy Gunner activate! Absolute zero! My turn! Pierce through! Rosetta Arrow! Yes! Ha! Now's the time! Follow up! My turn! I should fix my formations, to be honest. Dick move, by the way. What? Shine over us all! Yes! Here I go! Take this! Ha! Yes. Arcus, activate! My turn. Yeah. Ah, oh, come on. Yeah. It's my turn. Ready? Ha! There. I've got you. This is it. <laughs> for all the help, Tio. I should be the one thanking you, Ellie. Nice. Ah, the usual swarms of military monsters and archaisms. Yeah! It's hard to predict which of the two we'll run into next, though. We have the yeah. Red Constellation yeah. and just Ouroboros' the Enhanced Jaegers to watch out for as well. The Enhanced Jaegers are just a bunch of small fry, at least. Just give me the word. Yeah. Something tells me someone is here. I don't know who. But we're about to find out. I have a lot of frontline members. <laughs> Which is it exactly the best comp for a frontline team? Hmm. 
No enemies so far. I think this corridor may be where I tried to stop Instructor Reen two years ago. <laughs> oh, right. Back when he did stuff to you and then ran off with the princess. What a creep. Fuck! He's beyond despicable. How could he do that to such a precious, innocent young girl? Feels fucking bad, man. Now, now, everyone. Don't tease him like that. Oh, he's pretty popular. It's fine if we make fun of him a little. <laughs> he brought this upon himself. God dang it, it's just an all reen hate party. Uh, uh, feels fucking bad, man. Honestly, I'm actually scared, but we'll see how this goes. Ah, <sighs> how nice. Let me guess, Gilbert. It's prediction. They're gonna have to send out their weakest unit, Gilbert. Watch out, everyone. Eh? Yuna. Ah. Yuna, come this way. Fucking Yuna! Horrible minds, what a dirty tactic. Whoa, that was close. Thanks, guys. No worries, we gotta keep each other safe. I have a feeling I know who set these traps. Speak to up the devil, the ex-secretary <laughs> Ruan. Just thought I'd swing by and say hello. Gilbert. Ouroboros enhance the Aegers just like in Homo. You can, and should, address me as Gilbert Stein, regimental commander of the 6th Enhanced Jaeger Brigade. Uh. I'll thank you to forget about my old job title. The mere thought of those days brings a tear to my eye. As crappy your career path is, is your own fault, I heard you were stopping around Erebonia. I see you're back at it again. Remember when you helped us out? We'll have to Gilbert, huh? What? You worked together with a guy like this? We prefer when the Court of Shadows appeared, right? You really done your homework. Then again, I suppose you are from the Intelligence Division. That was then. This is now. I only graced you with my help because the situation called for it. Nothing more. In the three years since, I've been climbing the ranks in Ouroboros, rung by rung. Though I've suffered a few setbacks here and there, I know this time I'll make it to the top. They'll make me an enforcer for sure. Or maybe even an anguis. Good goddess. There he goes again. We don't need a whole preamble for every fight. Uh. How about you stow your mouth and show your commander some respect? You're deluded if you think you can hold us back with this pathetic brigade of yours. Better not underestimate us. We're gonna send all you running with your tails between your legs. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. What's that noise? It's a flying archaism. It's the same one you use in Phantasma. You don't mean that? What? Gilbert's personal area eight arcades and G up How do you EX. like this? A pital archaism? Got not this thing again. But I could have swarmed the epically haired priest that destroyed it back in the royal capital. <laughs> oh he did! But after my heroic self-sacrifice in Phantasma, I had the 13 factories build me another! But don't think it's the same as the old one. This model rolled out just the other day. Greater and grander than ever before! That sounds like Orbo or Six Sanguis at work. Mad scientist strikes again. I'm getting strange sense of deja vu here. Marveling in fear, are you? You should consider this an honor! 
history will remember you as yet another victory on the increasingly impressive resume of the great Gilbert Stein! Oh, you're in for a real wake-up call, pal. They're coming. Come on, let's get out of this career short. I'll wipe the floor with you! What the? Beat all enemies. It's my turn. Hmm. Hmm. I need a defensive order. But the only defensive order we have is Ebon Crystal, Aeon Shield, and goddamn Adamantine Formation. Ow. Yes. What? Shine over us all. Eat this. Keep it up. Thank you. It's my turn. Bring it on. Add a man type formation. Leave it to me. This is me hoping. Not a chance. We can you are this. finished. <laughs> Leave it to me. Hold on, let me scan one more. Yeah. <laughs> Not yeah. a chance. Let's go! Yeah. Orbal Gear EXA, activate! Ha! Orbal Laser, fire! Yeah. Let's go! It's my turn. Commencing drop. There. Let's go. Ha! Take this! Hurricane! <laughs> uh, they're down! Follow up. Leave it to me. More defensive formation. Bring it on! Add a man type formation! Leave it to me. I got an idea for you. There. You're finished. Not a chance. Get him. Follow up. My turn now. Give it to me! Orcas activate! My turn! What? Shine over us all! Yes.
Ready? My turn. Huh? <laughs> My turn now. Take this! Hurricane! Get him! Follow up. Leave it to me. Here's through! Rosetta Arrow! <laughs> Let's do it! I've got you! <laughs> Ow. I failed! There! Oh, it's my turn. Ready? Damn you! But, but how? This is the latest model! <laughs> Shut up. It's my turn. Shut up. Huh? You're finished! Oh, yes! What's weird about this team is that we don't really have like, you know, defensive orders except for like Estelle. <sighs> They're too strong. Pull yourselves together. We can't let the Red Constellation see us like this. And Gilbert, Jonathan. my reputation as your commander's at stake. At this rate, wait, what's happening? <laughs> That's... Oh, never mind. <laughs> well, looks like that model was still in under development. Hey, how embarrassing to be a member of the same organization as an idiot of this caliber. Should I restrain him? No, time, leave him. I'll join up the other team on the upper deck. Right. It's just up the stairs ahead. I, re I realized a big flaw with my master plan. We're gonna have to need another physical user. Or we could just bring Ren. Lloyd's team will be taking on the Red Constellation. I hope they'll be alright. Of course they will. They've got Joshua and Reen with them too. Yeah. Let's go join the others up on deck.
Alright, Estelle has no mana. This is a bit worrisome for me, but what can you do? So, see you guys all in the next part.